Hello, this is Mr. Buffington, and I'm going to show you really quickly how to navigate through the course to be successful this year. The first thing is that we, when you log into the course, you'll see at the top announcements, and along here you'll see all the announcements I have for you. The coursework announcement will show you all the things you need to do in the course with a date the coursework that you have to do and a recorded link or a link for a live session the first day we're having a live session at 2.30 so there's a link there and there's no graded activity on the second day here's the work that you'll do the lesson link and the quiz that you'll complete it's all listed right there inside of that coursework announcement there will usually be a weekly announcement as well and inside the weekly announcement it will show all the live sessions that we have all of the tests quizzes extra credit anything that's there um, practice tests things that are there to help you succeed that will all be inside of the announcements so the first key to succeeding in the course is reading the teacher announcements the next key to success inside the course is knowing that you will need to spend about an hour each day inside of the lessons, the mini lessons and the quizzes. That all working together will take about an hour. Here's what I would do to be successful in the course. I would log in, see if there's any new announcements. Then I would know by my coursework which lesson I need to be on. So let's say it's September 2nd. I would go to Unit 1, Lesson 1. Here it is, 1.01. That's Unit 1, Lesson 1. And I would click on that lesson for today. After I finish reading that entire lesson, then I would also attend a math lesson at 2.30. This is kind of an introduction lesson, so it's not a great example. But on the next day, I would read through all of Unit 1, Lesson 2, because it's September 3rd. I would read the entire lesson. Then I would open my textbook to page five and seven, five to seven and read that. I would complete the odd numbered problems from one to 12 on page seven. I would watch this mini lesson and then take the 1.02 quiz, which is located right here. So each day, these are the basic steps of being successful. You read your announcements. You complete your coursework. You read the entire online lesson, do the work in the textbook, watch the mini lesson, and then take the quiz. On some days, like test days or days when there's live sessions, there will be other information in here. But generally, this is the pattern that you'll follow to be successful. If you have any questions, my teacher contact information is up here. This is where I list my phone number. Kmail, please contact through Kmail. There's my Yahoo Instant Messenger, Buffington Agora, and office hours will be posted inside of the announcements. But there's my contact information if you need to ask me any questions. There's also another piece of information up here that's pretty helpful, and that is the Class Connect section of the course. In this section of the course, it also advises you to read through the online lessons, watch the recording, complete your textbook work, and take the quiz. It lists those four steps for success. But then down here it has listed all of our mini lessons. So if you scroll down just a little bit, for all of Unit 1, Unit 1, Lesson 1, there's no recording. For Lesson 2, this is the recording. For Lesson 3, that's the recording. And as you go down, there's a recording for each lesson. And these mini lesson recordings are designed to help you do well on the quiz. That's what they're designed for. So if you read the full lesson, watch this mini lesson, and then complete your textbook work, you will be prepared to take the daily quiz and get five out of five or four out of five. Do really well on those quizzes. That's what those are designed for. So that is the four success keys to success inside of this course. You'll also have some other information coming at you later on, but basically you do those four things listed right here 
and you will be successful in the course. I'll show you briefly one more time. First thing you do is read all of your announcements. Then each day you're going to read your full lesson, complete your textbook work, watch the mini lesson, and then take the quiz. I hope that that information has been helpful for you. Have a wonderful day.